Hello everyone, my name is Venera Nabebi Filotio. I'm the first master student of Faculty Economic and Businesses Tanjung Pura University on the Management Department, special to Mr. Arman Jaya, SPDE MM, as my lecture for Introduction Computer Application and Big Data. This is my odd midterm exam academic year 2022 until 2023. So on this video, it told us to um, numbering depends on the alphabeting, find the average, maximum, and the minimum, and determine whether the student is passed or not. So for this point, we have to numbering based on the alphabeting. So the way how we do it is just block on every student's name and their score and then we go to the data then we choose the sort from a to z and then there you go so on this point it asks us to calculate the average maximum and the minimum of every categories from Sanam to the athletic so for the average we can calculate it with this equation equals to average open bracket then we block on every score on Sanam category then we can close bracket and then enter it then we to make it easier we can drag them until the athletic categories and for the maximum one we can use it, the equation which is equals to max open bracket then we block on every score on categories of Sanam, then close bracket and then enter. Then make it easier, we can drag them until the athletic categories. This Do the same thing, equals to minimum, and then open bracket, block every score again in categories of Sanam, then close bracket and then enter. Then we can do the same thing, which is drag them. So for the average one, we can um, minimize the decimal using by block them and then we go to the decrease maximal, decrease the, sub, the decimal, then we can um, use it as we want, which is I wanted one numbers behind the comma, one decimal, I mean. So for the next point, it asks us to calculate the average, minimum, and the maximum on every um, combination categories on every student. So on this point, we can use the same formula as before, which is equals to average, then open bracket, then we block on every score in each student's gap and then close bracket and then enter it and then we can to make it easier we can drag them until the last student and there we go for the maximum one equals to maximum max open bracket then we block the numbers the score that each person get on every category then close bracket and then we enter it then we can block drag until the bottom one to make it easier for the max minimum one it was the same minimum open bracket block the score on every category for each student then close bracket then enter it and we can drag them until the bottom one to make it easier and there we go for the last point is it asks us to determine whether the student is passed or not by their average score if the average score is six or um, above it was passed and if they are below six so they aren't passed so the way how we answer the equation is <clears throat> equals to if open bracket block this average score that we already calculated before and then bigger than equal to six semicolon <clears throat> double quotes so on this 
I said make uh, double quotes. It was the um, the words or maybe the typing that we answer that will be um, shown if the average score is bigger or equals to six. So we can enter it pass. Then um, double quotes again to close it. Then semicolon. So for this point, we can we have to enter the new equation again. Okay? Equal. Um, so semicolon if open bracket um, block the average score again, and then smaller than six um, semicolon. Then double quotes. And for this point, it was smaller than six. So it was it wasn't passed so we can enter the um, word or typing is not passed and then close break, um, double quotes and then we can close the equation with double close bracket and then enter it so on this point it, it already finished and to top it off we can drag um, until the last student and there we go so that's all for my Oak Midterm Exam Academic Year 2022 until 2023 of Introduction, Computer, Application, and Big Data. Thank you and goodbye.